chapter on the Qibla for the people of al Madina, Sham, and the East. The Qibla is neither to the East nor to the West for the people of al Madina, as the Prophet peace be upon him said to them. Do not face Qibla, Garba at Mecca, during defecation and urination in an open space. Face either East or West. Narrated Abu Ayyub al-Ansari, may Allah be pleased with him, the Prophet peace be upon him said, While defecating, neither face nor turn your back to the Qibla, Garba at Mecca, but face either East or West. Abu Ayyub added, When we arrived in Sham, we came across some lavatories facing the Qibla. Therefore, we turned ourselves while using them and asked for Allah's forgiveness. Chapter on the Statement of Allah And take you people, the maqam, place of Ibrahim, Abraham, or the stone on which Abraham, peace be upon him, stood while he was building the Kaaba, as a place of prayer, for some of your salah, for example, to Raqqa after the Qawaf of Kaaba. Quran, Chapter 2, Verse 125 Narrated Amr bin Dinar, I asked Ibn Amr, Can a person who has performed the tawaf around the Kaaba for Umrah, but has not performed the tawaf, Sa'i, going of as safa and Al-Marwa, have a sexual relation with his wife? Ibn Umar replied, When the Prophet, peace be upon him, reached Mecca, he performed the tawaf around the Kaaba, circumambulated it seven times, and offered a two-rakar sada, prayer at the place behind the maqam, place of Ibrahim, Abraham, and then performed the tawaf, sari, going of as-safa and al-marwa. And verily, in Allah's Messenger, peace be upon him, you have a good example to follow. Then we put the same question, as in the above hadith number 395, to Jabir bin Abdullah, and he too replied, he should not go near his wife for sexual relation till he has finished the qawaf, sa'i, going of as-safa and al-marwa. Narrated Mujahid Someone came to Ibn Umar and said, Here is Allah's Messenger, peace be upon him, entering the Kaaba. Ibn Umar said, I went there, but the Prophet, peace be upon him, had come out of the Garba, and I found Bilal standing between its two doors. I asked Bilal, Did the Prophet, peace be upon him, offer salah, prayer, in the Garba? Bilal replied, Yes. He prayed to Raqqa between the two pillars, which are to your left on entering the Garba. Then Allah's Messenger, peace be upon him, came out and offered a two Raqqa salah facing the Garba. Narrated Ibn Abbas, may Allah be pleased with him, when the Prophet, peace be upon him, entered the Kaaba, he invoked Allah in each and every side of it, and did not offer salah, prayer, till he came out of it, and offered a two rakar prayer, facing the Kaaba, and said, This is the Qibla. Footnote The word Qibla means the direction in which all Muslims turn their faces in salah, prayers, and that direction is towards the Karba in Mecca, Saudi Arabia. The narration of Bilal, hadith number 397, is more authentic as Ibn Abbas did not enter the Karba with the Prophet peace be upon him, but narrates the episode from another companion.